Hi everyone, so good to be back with you once again. I would like to spend some time talking on the subject of prayer. And so for the next few broadcasts, that's what I want to focus on. You know, it's vital, it's so important for every Christian, for every believer to pray. And yet many Christians find it hard to pray, difficult to pray. Prayer is simply talking to God. It's you expressing your heart, your concerns, anxieties, your plans, your purposes, those things that worry you, those things that take up your, your life and your mind and the thinking, your troubles, whatever it is. That's what prayer is all about, talking to God. He is your heavenly father. He wants to hear the voice of you, his son, his daughter. I'm often reminded of God in the book of Genesis who would walk in the cool of the day and he would meet with Adam and Eve and they would talk, they would commune, they would have fellowship, they would share. It must have been an incredible experience. That's what prayer is all about. It's not complicated. There's no principles, there's no steps. It's simply you coming to the Lord and sharing your heart with him. You know, in Luke chapter 18, Jesus spoke a parable and he said that men always ought to pray and not lose heart. One version says, not grow faint. In other words, if I allow my life and the circumstances of my life to overwhelm me, the troubles, the day-to-day -day living, you know, that the grind of each and every day, if I allow that to take over my thoughts, my energy, and, and it just overwhelms me, something's not right. We need to pray. All these things, they weigh us down. They can trouble us. They sap us of energy and of life. Prayer is coming to God. Before discouragement, we need to pray. Before any worry settle in, we need to pray. It's our first port of call. Paul writes in 1 Thessalonians 5 and he says, pray without ceasing. It's not a specific time. It's not a specific place. It can be wherever you are, we need to pray. Prayer opens the door of faith. You know, Matthew 14, when Jesus was on the water, Peter went out to meet him, walking on the water. What an incredible experience. But Peter was overwhelmed. And at that moment, when the waves and the wind were too much, he stretched his hand out to Jesus and Jesus took it. That's what prayer is. Prayer is reaching out to the Lord. Prayer is crying out to God. Prayer is saying, Lord, I need you. I want to walk with you, to talk with you. That's what prayer is all about. Pray today. Pray right now. God wants to hear you. God bless you.